How do you establish trust when building relationships? I mean, ultimately, trust is about two different people in, in uh, interacting. And so I think it's about really getting to know someone beyond just a professional relationship. Uh, I think I actually really got that uh, lesson when I did some work in, in Dubai. Uh, and you couldn't start a meeting until you'd sat and spent you know, 15, 20 minutes really talking and probably getting to know more personal details than, than, were, than were necessary. But it was so that you really had a sense of who you were going to be working with. Um, and so I really try and do that with any interaction that I have, whether it's a, you know, a teammate and the first time I'm going to work with them, I sit down and you know, really try to give them a sense of my history, understand their history, where they're coming from, both on a personal and professional perspective, and trying to do the same thing with, uh, with clients that I've had from consulting. Uh, and so I think it's really about building sort of that common bond beyond just the business that's at hand. And what's been the response of the, the, the team members you've worked with as well as the clients uh, on your approach? I think fairly positive. So, uh, you know, some of the feedback that I've gotten uh, from working with my teams previously in consulting uh, is that I you know, spend a lot of my time trying to take an interest in them, making sure that they're going to develop, making sure that they realize that my role is, you know, to be successful as an individual, but also ensuring that they're going to be successful. Uh, and, I, and so I think that's been well received. Um, and I think in terms of the clients that I've had, um, probably it's demonstrated by the fact I, you know, continue to have a personal relationship with some of them even after I've stopped working with them. Uh, you know, if they come into town, we'll have, have meals. Um, and so I think it's, it's worked well. Uh, you know, and it's something I definitely didn't used to do maybe five or ten years ago. I thought, you know, business was business and, and private life was, uh, was personal. And, and I think the more that I've been able to integrate those two, the more successful that I've been.